Welcome back, guys. Let's pop into One Piece, episode 1092. Incredible. I just want to hit on some highlights of the episode and then jump into the real meat and potatoes of the thoughts that hit my mind as I was watching the episode. So, first, we find out Dr. Vegapunk actually exists in six separate robots referred to as satellites and that's why all these robots are calling themselves Dr. Vegapunk because they are all Dr. Vegapunk. He's divided himself between these so he can get more done, uh, accomplish more. Zoom over we see Rob Lucci and his team from the world government they are actually making their way to Egghead Island. We're gonna find out how that goes down because I'm pretty sure they don't know that the uh, Straw Hats are at the island. Uh, something has to do with Lelugia's eradication and now they're ordered to go take out Dr. Vegapunk so we'll see how all that unfolds. Next Luffy, Bonnie, Chopper, and Jinbei get some new futuristic looking clothes and it finally hit me what I was trying to remember seeing the, the style of the footwear on this island and that is it's a nod back to Astro Boy and boy what a load off when it finally hit me today I was like oh same 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 there we go all right after they get their new clothes they are chased by a pacifista because they haven't been paying for their food and clothes all this time they didn't know they had to pay for their food and clothes but here we are Luffy is going to fight the pacifista, but Bonnie begs him not to because when she sees the pacifista, she sees Kuma. It turns out Kuma is her father. Yes, we know this isn't the original Kuma, but it still brings up the emotions inside of her. And so we're going to see how that unfolds in the next episode. Zooming on, Trafalgar and his crew are approaching where Lelugia used to be. And Blackbeard's ship comes out of the mist and the wreckage of that area. And it looks like we're going to have a fight possibly between Blackbeard and Trafalgar. I'd be very interested to see how their powers clash between one another. Watching this episode, just one word popped up in my head and that is consistency. This show's gone through so many styles, settings, on different islands, so much world building, new characters, stories and it's never stopped feeling like One Piece throughout all of it and that's incredible I remember seeing a debate online it was, the whole thing was did Oda have the whole story planned out from the start or has he been coming up with new ideas along the way this the argument was suggesting oh if he uh, didn't have the whole thing plotted out from the start it's not as impressive and I will tell you, I, I will argue 100% that anyone who thinks that is not a creator, a writer, an artist, because I would argue personally, it's more impressive to be able to continue building on your idea for 27 years, mind you. <laughs> That's how old this thing is. To be able to keep expanding on your idea, building on it, and have it remain its core keep its core of what it is and also remain fun and exciting and to have any of the new ideas the new work never undermine or undo any of the previous work that is incredible to be able to to pull that off objectively whether or not this show is your cup of tea objectively simply to be able to have this thing maintain what it is for 27 years that alone respect just mad respect that might sound like the simplest thing but that can be the most difficult thing just keeping the work what it is keeping its identity because we've all watched a second series of something and thought what is this did we just forget about all the character development from the first season like what is this what happened so that's what I was thinking. Uh, let me know what you thought. By the way, if you've made it this far, I see we're up to 60 subscribers. I'm thrilled about that. I started this just five months ago. I don't know how fast it's supposed to grow, but uh, that seems cool to me uh, to know even 60 people are enjoying it. I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know what you thought of the episode or just what you thought about uh, all of this. So, see you next time.